Whether you have a high-end or low-end PC, Overwatch performance can be a problem for everyone because of one simple issue, something that I suffered from, and I managed to fix it. So here's how I did it. For reference, I'm running on Windows 10, I have an i7-7700K, a GTX 970, and 16 gigabytes of RAM. But it should be noted that I had this problem with the GTX 760 and 950, and I don't think that this is only a problem on Nvidia cards, and it's not a problem just on Intel processors either. Simply put, in Overwatch, when your CPU usage goes up, your GPU usage will go down. Now this is an obvious problem. Why, when things get more intensive, does the GPU usage go down? If you want to test this out for yourself, get a program like MSI Afterburner to show you your GPU usage and your CPU usage. Just to note though, your GPU usage will always be above 95% in the practice range except for when you're in menus of course, so don't go there to test it, you'll have to load up like a versus AI or something. Just for reference, on my setup, the 7700K and the 970, I went from 120 average FPS in combat to 180 FPS average in combat. That's a 50% increase. Now to fix this problem, there are a few things that we can use to do first to make sure that you're getting the most performance possible. Firstly, make sure that your video card drivers are completely up to date. Secondly, make sure that your settings are actually optimized for your PC. I've linked a guide in the description to show you how to get the highest frame rate with reasonably good looking settings. Now there are a couple of methods that I've seen online that are not what I'm going to be recommending today. Those methods are increasing your anti-aliasing settings and or increasing your render scale. Those are settings that, for me at least, took all of the performance gain of the GPU usage and took it away because of the increased processing my GPU had to do. So anyway, the actual fix for this problem, at least for me and I think most people, go into your BIOS. That's right, reboot your computer, go into your BIOS, and disable HPET. Now for me, it was really easy. In my BIOS, I just had to do a quick search, and there it was. To quickly explain what HPET is, Microsoft describes it as a new system timer that is needed in chipsets to replace legacy timers and to meet the needs of time-sensitive applications. Now, basically what this means is that it should increase performance, but I did a quick CPU benchmark before and after this, and I noticed no difference. It was within a 1% you know, margin of error sort of deal. So I'm gonna say that it doesn't really matter on Windows 10 at least. So anyway, once you've disabled HPET, boot right back into Windows, open up MSI Afterburner or your program of choice, Watch the CPU and GPU usage and you should see that there's no dip in GPU usage when your CPU usage goes up. If this didn't help you, leave a comment and I'll try to get back to you and help you resolve this problem. You can always take it to the Overwatch forums as well and say that you've already tried all of the recommended steps. This is a problem that they've known about for a while and they're suggesting that people send in their system information so that they can look further into it. But for right now, without any official patch or anything like that, this video is probably your best bet for fixing this problem.